Greetings, my fellow Americans, and thank you for joining me back here in Kaiserreich playing as America, the United States of America. Now, look at this. This picture looks amazing. This is what America should always look like, if not an expansion into our hat, or our pokey, we'll call it. So eventually, I might, we might want to take out Canada. We, we will definitely take out Mexico by the end of this campaign, but we also own Alaska too, which looks really good, even though we need to get Hawaii back. And probably Puerto Rico. So, America is reunited. At long last, America, America has been reunited. We stretch once again from she, she, sea, to shining sea. I apologize, I apparently cannot speak right now. The traitors to the country have been destroyed, and the stars and stripes now fly proudly from coast to coast, knowing that liberty is secured for all. A more perfect union. Yes. More perfect union. Where eventually we will reclaim Hawaii, maybe in this episode. We will want to go to take a fight, or take the fight, to Japan someday. And, wow, that's fast. Floyd Olson passes away. A today unfortunate news... Uh, was received from the Minnesota home of the former Senator Floyd Olson. He died from stomach cancer that had reoccurred. This comes as a shock as many believe his cancer was cured a great loss. We greatly disagreed with him on policy, but you know what? Later rest. You know what? That's why you don't elect him. He died of cancer. You, you, you just can't. I'm sorry. You just can't. He needs someone who's going to be here for a long, long time. But we do have a couple comments to get to. Uh, which we might as well address first. First of all, oh, there goes the Dominican Republic. Someone recommends I join the fight. Well, we are in the Entente, but we're going to join the fight against the Third International. We probably will, honestly. If the Germans can't break the Third International, the Third International will probably break the Germans. Which they did push back the Germans a little bit, actually. They even took a Dunkirk, which is interesting. We have education, army, army education done. We will have to kill off Mexico eventually, so there's that. Let's see, we can do radar. Take the fight abroad. Eh, not bad. Land doctrine bonus is always good. Back in business. Uh, let's see. Rebuild the Monroe Doctrine. Enter the fray. We might do that one. We're not going to do Fortress America. There's no way we're going to do the Arsenal of Democracy. I don't know, man. Democracy? Let's we'll see what happens. Working with our allies. The American Century. Pax Americana. I kind of like that one. Rifle Domain. Treaty of Cooperation. Um, I, I, I don't know about that one, man. I don't know. I don't know. Let's do it up the traders. Our intelligence services have identified the enablers of radicalism and greed in America. They are the disloyal prohibit oh, prohibitionists, grangers, holy rollers, and foreigners that have enabled the AFP and the SPA to grow. These organizations have been rightfully banned for their implicit betrayal. Oh, ooh, we need to get this one too for more civilian construction speed. Not bad, not bad. We do have a fifth research slot. A fifth one. It's not America until you have more than, than enough research slots. Well, we can't do anything there. We are in the IEDC, which gives us 20%. Construction speed bonus to what we want to build, which is awesome. And we also obviously have no stability, which is fine. We're trying to get some more refineries, trying to build up some more civilian factories in Indiana, oh, Illinois, Pennsylvania's getting some more refineries, even more military factories in New York City of all places. Even in, in Ohio, we're building ourselves up. I have no intention of joining joining the fight against enemies now. And also, we need to talk about this. I made a lot of militia divisions, which aren't bad. They're okay. Really, though, I do want to make sure everyone's at least infantry division like this. That'd be good. Best inf... Uh, go ahead and get rid of this garbage. I don't even want to check it out. We'll change whatever we need to change with whatever stuff. Oh my goodness, there's a lot. Best infantry, 40 combat width. Those are some thick boys. This is what we made earlier. This is what the standard unit everyone should be. Uh, oh, duck yards. Oh, we need to research more stuff. Oh, we really, really want to use carriers. So we're going to keep going with the carrier idea for now. We don't really need to use that many carriers. At least one per task force would be nice. So let's go ahead and keep making some more cruiser hulls. I think that would probably be best for now. We also don't have any political power, but whatever. Oh, we got some ships. Ooh, destroyers, cool. I'll destroy you right there, and then you guys, I'll throw you right there. And then you guys, most submarinos, great. Go ahead and train as well. Do that, ooh, yeah, that's right. And then you guys, ah, an approved cruiser hull. I love it. Research. Shall do, we, it's 1940. You have to get nukes, is MacArthur. If you don't get nukes, are you really playing MacArthur correctly? You're not. Y you gotta get nukes. Also, air supply. We need a ton of artillery. We need a ton of support equipment. Actually, we, were, we weren't making any at all, apparently. So, we really need to get some more support equipment. We also sent volunteers to Russia last time. Uh, we have our guys here. Pretty cool. You guys. You, they can, please don't tell me the Ukrainians can pierce you, because that'd be so sad if they could. Oh, yeah. Beat them down. Beat them down. Now, we'll, we'll send volunteers to the Reich's Pact if Russia loses, but I can't imagine Russia loses right now or anytime soon. We'll beat these guys up next. Let, let's let the guys get over here. No, I'm not joining the war. Nope, not yet. It's not in our best interests. Uh, a bunch of horses cannot beat the superior armor of Adna Archafi, or Kathy, or whatever, however you pronounce it. 
beautiful. I wonder if you can actually make an encirclement here. That'd be kind of wild, don't you think? I'm thinking that'd be kind of wild. We've got to wait for more infantry to show up, though. Oh, uh, let's see. I deck. Cool, cool, cool. And I'm joining with my cat, Binky, sleeping on my other chair as I am here. Good. Going, going. There, a couple of the comments. Is use amphibious tanks. I asked you guys yesterday whether I should use amphibious tanks or not. And so I'm thinking, you know what? Why not? Let's use them. Amphibious tanks sound really, really cool. Can you get in? Oh, we were attacked. Can you get in there before he does? You probably can't. Oh, we did! Cool! We actually got in there. So, I do want to use amphibious tanks. I put them on our marines, because I've never used them in any campaign before, so... I'm very interested in using them. Very, 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 very much so. Cool. We're going to smash horse division. Oh, Santa Claus bombings. That's why we got to root out the traitors. This expires in the 41, which isn't bad. Happy June, though. Happy June. Nice little month. Let's go ahead and do that. You should be fine. You could probably do it by yourself, but give them some extra support. As long as they can't pierce us, that is awesome. Actually, how much armor do they have? They have 9.3, which isn't a lot, but that's okay. 1940. Immediately go ahead and get some better carrier fighters. That would be good. We could get upgrades, but I'm going to save that for later. It's probably for the best. Let's go ahead and get a few more things from South Africa. There you go. That should help our construction of capital ships, because we need a massive navy. Yeah, really, I would like to have six research slots, but I don't think that's going to happen. This is going to definitely help out the front. Last time we helped out Finland, which is in the Third International, which isn't very good. If the Reichspact does fall, and Third International does win against, you know, these guys, I want Russia and the Third International to fight each other. I will purposely make it like that if I have to. I'm not, I'm not going to help out right now, just because uh, there's no point. They don't have their divisions around here, so there you go. Not going to help out. Cool. You might as well help out here then. Do. Great. Give us more experience. Especially for tanks. We definitely need more tank experience. Looking better. Not looking good at all. Holy cow smoke arenos. Good job, guys. You've done a great job. We should probably get a, get a field marshal. Uh, eh, we'll use you. Why not? Oh, actually. We should have used you. Uh, yeah, honestly, you're probably better. Yeah. Well, actually, you're, actually, you're not better. But you do have reckless armor. And then we have a Panzer leader too, so whatever. I don't really care. And then we'll become more offensive, which would be nice. We love being offensive. Mm, is there any, oh, they got some guys down here too. Well, that's not good. Uh, is there any place good that we can make for an encirclement? Perhaps, perhaps, perhaps. Uh, just going to push in first, that's fine. They're just militia divisions. Militia is so incredibly weak, which I do want to get rid of. But let's, we're going to lower our artillery deficit first. And then change these divisions to... Ooh, long bombings, that's not good. Not these divisions. The militia divisions straight up to at least these guys. I don't like the other fish. Oh my gosh, look at how much we need. Oh yeah. And that's why I'm not switching them yet, so. You can switch one, maybe, probably. We'll have enough for that, but. No, we don't even have enough for that. Okay. No, uh, you know what? Don't even do that. I'm just gonna hold. You you can weaken them, that's fine, but. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. You guys come over here. You guys are you guys should be pretty darn fast. What's your speed? Oh. Oh never mind, they're only two. Rooting out the traders, good. Empower the army. Get more population, stability. Let's begin reconstruction. The nation has suffered much long before this war started. It is both a monumental task and opportunity to tran unify transportation networks and push through bolder economic ideas that elevate American industry above this ailing world. You helped us, we'll help you later on. That's how it works. Oh, we can fight terrorists. Oh, that sounds like an, such an American thing to do. We're going to get rid of these goddamn terrorists. The Red Scare, since Garza has taken power, he has begun a campaign against socialism, anarchism, and syndicalism. They are, after all, the main instigators of the Civil War, and as such, all Americans must know the role that they played in the conflict, and as such, the so-called Red Scare begins, many being forced out of jobs and being blacklisted. Better dead than red. God dang, you know that right. Cool, cool, cool. Oopsie. Sorry, I just dropped my pen. My bad. The guys get over here. Uh, we'll probably put down the socialists first, and then we'll put uh, take out the longest next because socialists are probably well. They, you just said better dead than red, so we might as well. Oh, uh, why are you? Oh, uh, why did you do that? We could have encircled them. We could have had glory, lots of glory, and encirclement. But okay, whatever. Syndicalist bombings. This is why we got to take out these goddamn terrorists first. Actually, what type of debuffs do they give us? Overwhelming longest, overwhelming socialist, that's fine. Makes sense. Alright, keep going, keep going, you're doing fine. Break them up, they can't hurt you that bad, right? Now nah, they can't pierce us, which is awesome. How many minutes we've we lost? We've lost 520, which is quite a few guys, actually. Nice job, guys. Oh, we're definitely making gains down here in Russia. I mean, Ukraine. Close enough. 
Whee! Oh, what the? What the heck? Right here, guys. This way. Your other direction. Only get 0.59 a month. Jesus, that's not much. Ah, uh, 34% priority popularity. That's oh, we're still on early mobilization. Good. Oh, we want to go to partial mobilization though. As soon as we start making or repairing these stuff, it, we're not going to do that. Here we go here. We're not going to do that. And y'all take forever to move. Oh, hold on. Step out here then. Nice. You want to help out then? Yeah, they're pushing in. I mean, we might as well help out, man. Now we good. Longest bombings. No, no, no. Go and help out too. If we can kill these guys off faster than these guys, that'd be great, great, great. Which we should be able to do. Manpower, not looking bad. We get a little less than 3,000 a month, which isn't great, but whatever. Come on, get in there. Good job. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, we could try to get to Kiev, but eh, we'll see what happens. We could go over there. I say just wait until the infantry get up to the line. Slowly crushing the German Empire over here. Yeah, the German Empire is probably going to fall. The Reichsback's going to die. That's what they get for sending soldiers against me in my own civil war. That's what they get. Beautiful. Nice. Just beautiful. You know what? We're America. We can afford another one. Why not? Uh, Russian Empire. Don't want to give everything to South Africa, do we? Go ahead. Oh, very nice, very nice. 1940 stuff. We could get better artillery. Um, amphibious tanks. Why is it... Oh, we can already go ahead and research this. Oh, that's cool. It says 41 or 40. Oh, it is 40, maybe. That's nice. Let's go and do that. Cool. And also, there's another comment. I need to keep addressing more comments because I keep forgetting about them. Uh, use signal companies. Yes, I actually almost never use signal companies, so I'm actually interested in using them again. They get into battle more quickly. I think they can reinforce better. Uh, use armored cars. That's something else we also have to research, so that'll be good to do. Uh, good, 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 good. I just want to take you up now. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there's some support for me to fight. Canada, the Entente. I could take them all out, probably. And eventually, I could probably definitely take them all out. And Kiev is ours. Good. Or the Russians. Cool. Um, yeah. I'll probably go with reaffirm the Monroe Doctrine. Just kill everyone else in South America just for funsies. And Canada, and Mexico, and all them. Really stretching out their lines. Very cool. Next up is... Oh, yeah. I talked about Puerto Rico's flag. It's not an... I knew it wasn't an Iron Cross. It's not an Iron Cross. It's more like the Cross of Jerusalem. Which is very cool. Very, very cool. So... We might go to war with Puerto Rico. If we go to war with Puerto Rico, they'll probably join the Third International. Probably not, actually, since they're national populace. They might join the Reichs Pact, actually, if anything. Alright. Alright. At this point, you guys... Head right here. Let me go, go right on ahead. I, I don't think this is going to be too much of a problem. I could be wrong, but... Just kind of have a good time, you know. Just have a good time. If you can get to Odessa, you might capitulate the Ukrainians. And we've done it. Don't let them in, please. Hey, we did it. Hey, see, told you. Wow, that was really fast. Holy cow. That's a lot faster than I expected. Oh, God, Belarus. Don't, doesn't Belarus have, like, a lot of swamps? It looks like they got a lot of swamps. You rub my back, I rub your leader's back. That sounds kind of weird. Uh, wait, where did the front line go? What the heck? I definitely did not put it there. Uh, please, please. Thank you. Thank you. Go, go, go. Begin reconstruction. Thank you. Oh, trial the traitorous companies. Oh. Considering the companies that support rebels and traitors shall begin. Civilian factories? Oh my goodness, this looks amazing. Yeah, we don't care. It's entirely army. I want to do this one too. More stability, more readable population factor is so important to get. Control Congress, martial law. I love martial law. But I don't want to do it too much yet. Stability is so good, but we get more weekly change for now since we're so low. I want to go with this. Business subsidies. Small businesses in America have struggled to expand employment opportunities, which is contributing to unemployment. The issue of unsafe working conditions returning to prominence due to the need for faster production has led to an agitated workforce. Congress has approved of a federal purse to subsidize small businesses. Just make sure they don't abuse it too much. Rebuild the South. Ooh, we get free cores on them. Oh, well, it's not free. We have to pay for it, but whatever. Um, ooh, it's probably better to get cores on this stuff and more stability and war support. But I do want to fight the, the you know, terrorists. That sounds so American. That just feels American to say. We're here to kill the terrorists. Ooh. Yeah, let's reduce that back. Get more stability, get a more war support. That's always nice. 25, though. I might reclaim Hawaii. We can build the south. 
Mm, Pacific Coast bombings. Honestly, though, Pacific Islands, Puerto Rico will get there eventually. Pacific Coast. Uh, I don't mind California, actually. California, Rocky State, just Nevada. That. Okay. This West, just West. Wait, wait, wait is West Virginia not a core? West Virginia is a core. These are all cores already, so I'm just gonna go ahead and fight the longest first. Yeah, we gonna do that first, son. We actually might not win here. Mm, yeah, go now. Well, for now. Yeah, these guys are still reacting to the loss of the Ukrainian lands. Nope. I'm gonna make the Third International stronger by killing off the Reichs Pact. Hmm, not a good idea. Actually, not really a good idea at all. That's okay. Let's see what happens. Cool, as long as we get enough tanks. Artillery is looking great. Support equipment is still looking pretty god darn bad, though. 15, there you go. There you go. There you go. Yeah, we should probably make some medium tanks. Probably. Maybe. Oh, we need some tanks. There you go. Nice. Oh, I'll just do that. You cut them all off, which is great. Which is superb. Come on, get in there. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, actually, you know what? You hold. You hold him in place. There you go. Both together for victory. He's definitely learning a lot, which is great. Born in 1884. That's ever from Mexico. Kansas. That's kind of cool. And, of course, he was wounded. Of course. Um, uh, commando training? Sure, why not? We don't really need to do that right now. That's okay, though. You guys, just do Brazil. Doesn't really matter. I really don't care too much. Do that. Do that. You probably won't live. Do that. Don't have to bother that for that with that for a while. Good. Yeah, definitely keep making some more light tanks so we get some more recon. That'd be important. What are we making right now? No military factories? That is a big sin. The big sin. West Virginia. Yeah, there you go. Good enough. We got we got the refineries, I guess, as well now, which is good. Even though we're still out of rubber, not good. Whatever. If we can take these guys out, they get they should get no supplies. Ooh, Greece is gone, which means Belgrad Pact is falling apart, which is in the Reichs Pact. Oh, Belgrad Pact is fighting the Dona Adria Boon, which is a good thing. Long as bombings, Syndicalist bomb. God dang, so many bombings. There you go. I'm gonna have these guys rest for a little bit because supply is just so bad. Yeah, it's marshes, swamps, you know, all that good stuff. Just get over there and then we'll just kind of hang out. Don't even move. Just kind of sit there when you get to the line. Ooh, new normal. Oh, look, it's White Ruthenia. Great. So, when General MacArthur announced that he would not step down as leader those years ago, it was under the pretense of emergency. At the time, hundreds of thousands of Americans, or Americas, Americans, were unaccounted for. Radicals proud the country said funding their politics with looted money, and the Democratic pillar was unready to hold up the state. These past few years have seen a great many galvanized into hardy MacArthurites, and a new flavor of politicians emerge in the House of Representatives. These congressmen see the need for an integral military role to check and nurture the business environment and ensure the rights of citizens cannot be infringed due to gridlock. Refuse the congressional au revoir. Add people. Social conservatism. Uh... Huh. Hmm. Galvanize into them. Endorse the new supporters. Hope this doesn't do too much. Rockefeller. Oh. Eh, we'll see what happens. That sounds kind of like fun. A little more flavor for us. Get over here so the supplies a little bit better. Oh, we're not going to have you fight because you're, you're out of tanks. You're just way too out of tanks. So, and motorized. Motorized. Where's my motorized? Oh. You're not motorized. You are motorized, though. Alright, very good. Germany is not having a good time. They are going to die, probably. Which is going to make it a lot more interesting when I invade Mexico, eventually. Ah, screw it. Just going to convert these guys. I hate seeing these militia divisions. I really do. Alright. Syndicalist bombings. Cool. You guys are looking great. Horses. I love the horses. They did a really great job. I'm going to pull you out, though. You're going to come right here. You guys are... The boulder dam was completed. Oh, I kept pressing... Exit, my bad. Or escape. Uh, this morning I came, I saw, and I conquered. 
uh, as everyone who would be sees for the first time this great fear feat of mankind. Ten years ago, the place where we gathered was a sparse forbidden desert, and the bottom of a gloomy canyon, those whose precipitous walls rose to a height of more than a thousand feet, flowed a turbulent, dangerous river. The mountains on either side of the canyon were difficult to access, with neither road nor trail, and the rocks were protected by neither trees nor grass from the blazing heat of the sun. The side of Boulder City was a cactus covered with, which I've been to Boulder City. The transformation wrought here in these years is a 20th century marvel. Thus begins Quentin Roosevelt's speech dedicating the creation of the Boulder Dam that has finally been completed today. And on behalf of the nation, to say to you, well done. Awesome. Col we just saw Colombia go this way. They just annexed Panama. We gotta get Panama Canal back. Oh, Canada invaded Pen Venezuela. Canadian intervention into foreign affairs? Oh, I like it. I was gonna see these guys are 18 combat with. Yeah, they're pretty darn veterans. But not good enough. There you go. Doesn't matter. Cool. Uh, I love this group, but uh, I can make them tanks, but now. Nah. Thank you. Thank you for your service. Business subsidies, very cool. Economic investments, keep going more. A more bold strategy is devised by Congress to assist in economic recovery. Traditional notions that government purchases are negatively associated with growth. Newer theories hold that smart purchases can stimulate the economy. One, two, three. It's only three factories. It's not really much, but whatever. Uh, I really don't want to get rid of these generals, but we don't need them right now so much. Let's see what happens. 1940. Uh, scout cars. I don't want to get too many armored cars. They're, I mean, they're good and all, but... Hmm. Carrier Universal Model 2, we could do that. Uh, signal, that's uh, eh, get the signal companies, why not? So it looks like we're probably going to end up needing two armies still, so you guys come up here. Really though, uh, okay. okay, you have no orders. From San Diego down to like Texas-ish. You, you guys go there, but you guys are on the other side here, helping out. Cool. I focus really hard on helping the Russians in this campaign so far. That's because they helped us. Not bad. A few weeks. That's not too bad. Oh yeah, the Russians are definitely pretty doing, doing pretty well. Doing pretty well for themselves. You're still injured, which is fine. You guys are just hanging out. You don't don't even move that really that much. There you go. Just don't hurt yourselves, guys. You're still needed. You're still necessary. Wow, we are really out of that stuff. Wowzers. At least make one. That's all we need, just one. The iDeck investment. Cool, we already did this. Invest in civilian factories. I'm gonna keep going with civilian factories because they take so much longer to build than military factories, so. Yeah, we're still fighting socialist terrorists. It's fine. Let time go on as fast as possible, even though it's pretty laggy. We're gonna ask for another investment of probably a hundred political power, most likely. Which we really don't have, but that's okay, whatever. Yeah, the Russians are just doing well on this front. After we capitulate the Ukraine, White Ruthenia. Yeah, they're not doing very well in Nancy, or near the Tsar. Tsar broken. Oh, the Anton's doing really well in India, though. I'd hate to be uh, the tip of India, though. That looks really bad. Cool. Advanced fire bases, great. China is a giant mess. Holy cow, United Provinces of China versus the Northern Zidi clique. Japan is just doing Japanese things. Oh, my goodness. Anton, the Reichsback is still down here. They'll probably get down there. They'll probably join the Anton eventually. If they lose, which they probably will. Uh, Donut Ijibun isn't doing that much better against Belgrade Pact at all right now. Yeah, the International's got to die someday. Oh, the Anton's doing really well, though. They really cleaned up Venezuela. Hmm. Oh, good. Get rid of these terrorists. God, that's, that's probably the biggest issue with me in Kaiserreich. It's still that lag, man. There's still some lag. I mean, yeah, I know the world is supposed to be pretty laggy right now, but still, man. Lithuania and longest bombings, cool. Well, not cool, but it is what it is. Rebuild the south. I, mean, I like those stability and war support. But still. Actually, how much do we invest in zero? 3%, 3%, 3%. Y, yeah, we gotta get that back. We'll, we'll focus on that when we have a bigger army. Probably. Probably. Cool. Not doing great. We're doing better on this. We're doing a little better on that. That's not bad. Uh, two things. Oh, we need both more, too, at the same time. Come on. If I zoom in, it might speed up the game a little bit more. Cool. Let's get at least two going at all times. That'd be good. 30%. Oh, Wisconsin's pretty well developed. There you go. Two military factories, two civilian factories, and maybe a third one as well. See what happens. Good. My goodness, the Russians are doing amazing right now. I've really helped them out. A replacement of a few good uh, light tanks. Does wonders for the body. You guys can probably help out, get a little more experience. 
Oh, Cinequas bombings. Go die somewhere else. By social terrorists. Good. More stability, more war support, more output. Yes, please. What are we at? Where are we at? We oh that's why we can't really build military factories that well. But civilian factories are doing pretty darn well. Nice. Doesn't really seem like we're getting that much more weekly uh, stability, but whatever. Fifth, that's not bad either. Nope. Oh, does it look like I'm ready to help out? Oh, there goes Carlos Spain. Nice. France. 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 Canada. I, I'm in no position to help out. Absolutely no position. God, I want to help out here. I think he probably win, so I'm going to help out. We sent him planes. Oh, we did send him planes. I love planes. Well, I guess I know even more planes. How many planes do we have? Uh, we don't have a lot of fighters. Uh, we got some. Let let time go on a little bit. Cool. Next up, rebuild America's industry. Oh, more construction speed. Yes, please. So, America's exports have fallen during the Depression despite taking a laissez-faire position on trade laws. Exports are also one of the main ways we measure economic activity. We must invest in this tertiary services of our industrial businesses in order to lower their bottom line and increase output. So we're going to go there, do ind American industrial might, and then do trial of traitorous companies. That'll be good. At least I, th I think that'll be good. God dang it. Oh, we got some scout planes as well. Nice. Do that. One. Put you guys down in half. Cool. I'm going to have actually one, two... Eh, throw all three of you there. That'd be fine. After today, you should be able to move over there pretty easily, right? No? Alright, if you don't really want to move, I'll move you up myself. There you go. I like green air. Green air is great. Come on. Oh man, they're, they've even pushed into Prussia. Oh my goodness, we're already in Königsberg. Jesus. Now the Germans were not ready for a two-front war. Not at all. Holy cow, they're getting smacked down. Man, the Germans might lose before the planes even get here. Come on, man. There goes Poland. Holy crap. Come on, guys. Please. Where are you? Are you still trying to... Oh, my goodness. The game is so laggy. It takes forever for them to get over. Oh, breaks my heart. Breaks my heart every time. Oh, wow. They really pushed through. Uh, over here, though. How's this looking? You might as well help out on this one. You'll do fine. We might not even get any army XP anyways. German Marines desperately trying to hold out. Desperately. Oh, look at that. That is disgusting. The Corlin pocket. Is that literally Corlin? That literally is Corlin. Oh, man. Seriously. The Germans might capitulate before the planes get here. The Russian bear is strong with American support. Oh, we're demobilizing. Ah, uh, recovering from the Civil War. Overwhelming longest resistance. Strong socialist resistance. Joel Bennett Clark. Yeah, I just, I really want to focus on industry, man. Industry is going to be so important for what we need. Cool, one of them should be here very soon. There we go. Elbing. How many light tanks do we not have? A thousand. That's looking slightly better. That's looking pretty much worse. Yeah, oh, we just got to build, build, build. I don't know why they keep wanting us to come to the war, but whatever. That's okay. Go and help out. If we can help out with, like, Equipment and stuff. That's okay. Hey, look. I don't think they're really attacking us. Oh, well, I mean, we're not really defending too much. Just a little bit. Oh, this is going to spell the end of the Reich's Pact. Oh, they've been pushing a little more into Belgium, even though Canada invaded here as well. What happens if you capitulate the Union of Britain before France? Hmm. Lavender Scare with the so called Red Scare underway. Douglas MacArthur has passed execu Executive Order 10. 450. That broadened the definition of a national security risk to include any criminal, infamous, dishonest, immoral, or notoriously disgraceful conduct, habitual use of intoxicants to excess, drug addiction, or sexual perversion. This has led to the firing of over 5,000 federal employees who were accused of being homosexual. The press has mostly approved of these measures, although a few tabloids claim we were preaching hypocrisy. One of the chief prosecutors, FBI Director J. Edgar Hoover, has been a long rumor to have been in the closet with his secretary, Clyde Tolson. Ooh, sounds kind of, uh closeted. Uh, as its director of the most important intelligence agency, Hoover is, of course, beyond investigation. Even if it were to, Ho Hoover probably has much more dirt on us than we have on uh, him. Oh boy. White House and Zandu. A surprising amount of support came from the pages of many Hearst newspapers that dot America. These papers draw up the image of MacArthur as heroic Cincinnatus. 
Hearing the call to save the Republic from de certain dest destruction, a beacon for MacArthur's allies and the creation of an almost mythical personage through films and newspaper cartoons, Hearst has served as a stabilizing factor to the ship of the state. Even Hearst's attacks on radical unions and populists seem to echo the words of MacArthur radio speeches. We appreciate your support. Oh, you bet your butt we do. You bet your took us we support your so we so we like your support. I can't word right now. Words are quite difficult. And not the bueno. Oh, it's quite a bit ahead of time. We can wait to do that. It's almost forty one. Come down here. Get some more construction speed. I am all about construction, man. I love industry. Alright, that's too much on roads though right now. That's too much on roads. Kentucky, you're up next. One, two, one, two. That's not bad. Uh even more civilian factories. We can always use more civilian factories and put them somewhere else. Fight long as terrorists? God dang terrorists. We might get some stability if we do that really as fast as possible. So we'll see what happens. Minus 9%. Not bad. Could be better. Could be worse. Double bonus for industry. Very good. You know, I do want this more. This, this is not very good right there. Great. And industrial... American industrial might. The war may have temporarily re reinvigorated heavy industry, but its war design was temporary and facilities were essentially built on top of closed factories. We must bring our safety and management efficiencies to bear in order to make this upswing permanent. Yeah, more construction speed, product cap, and output. Yes, please. For the love of God, we need that. Oh, nice. We like that, too. Go going to get some more output as well at the same time. Go, 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 go. We need more military factories. We need more light tanks. We need more artillery. We need more support equipment. America is not ready to fight as much as I want, it to, want her to be. It takes time to rebuild after Civil War. Go figure, you know. Yeah, it's, it's not a smart idea to attack there. If anything, I'm going to move you guys right here. There you go. Just move on down the line. You might get attacked here. You might not. You probably won't. That's okay. 255 factories is not enough. Oh, we're building some more. Uh, we could build up New Mexico later. Uh, I don't want to trade away for rubber, but yeah, since we got that, do that. Send to close bombings. Just do this one first because it's the last one in Ohio. That'd be fine. Over here, I'm, I'm going to save up for partial mobilization next. 5% more consumer goods is good. And we actually get a bonus to building more military factories as well as civilian factories, but military factories, we get a bigger bonus. Recovering from the Civil War. Oh my goodness, that hurts. That looks so bad. Oh, yeah, but really? I might send divisions to Austria. Yeah, how many can I send to? Yeah, I'm going to send them. Just because I'd like to see them do a little better. Uh, do we have Mountaineers? No, we don't, which sucks. Because there's quite a few mountains around there. That's fine. That's fine. You should be led by... Eisenhower. I don't really care about helping the Austrians too much. They did try to send some volunteers to us. Because I don't want to see these guys win that much more. Cool. How many planes can we send? Uh... Oh, quite a few, which is good. But I can only send them to Austria, which really sucks. Can I send you volunteers? Hopefully. There we go. That's really all you really need. It isn't bad. Close air support. We don't have enough close air support now. Uh oh. You can send some scout planes. You know what? Let me do some scout plane stuff. Scout over Mexico. Now that would be kind of cool. I never, almost ever use scout planes. Come on. There you go. There you go. Learn about what our Mexican ally, ally, neighbor is doing. Oh, we are getting attacked. Uh, can they pierce us? Oh, we're not the ones getting attacked, I guess, technically. Oh, uh, bombings, I hate them. Logistics. Get some of that on there, too. Good. We're doing better on artillery, which is nice. This is just the main episode for us to recover. That's probably the most important thing that we need right now. And they can kind of pierce us, which kind of sucks. We'll break him soon enough. That's okay. Hey, Austria! Where, where, did, where did we go? Oh, oh, you're already over here. Wow, that was fast. Galatz? That'd be good to get. Yeah, definitely don't want to be fighting in the mountains. That would suck. Okay, Eisenhower, see what you can do. We can probably take the city. That'd be nice. You guys are still trying to attack north. We got a little bit more support. Cuba's, Cuba's doing the Reichs Pact. Okay. Didn't really see that one going. Coming. That's okay. 0.5 political power day. Not bad. Take this and you take away a good chunk of their industry in Romania. Good, 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 good. Hey, we won. I almost never send two different 
uh, tiles or two different groups of volunteers at any one place because I hate fighting against multiple different fronts. Good job, guys. Switches out our line a little bit more. And industrial American might. We could get them off here, but we're not going to do that yet. Trial of Traitor's Companies. It is time for Congress to hear the testimony of the rebellious companies. Some are advocating for the for just their executives to resign, while others insist on piercing the corporate veil. This would allow the government to prosecute individual shareholders as responsible for the decisions made. Good. Very good. Come on, Austria. Get your soldiers down here. Stop dying. Uh, if I had another division, I'd throw them down there, but we just don't. And that's the big suck. You guys are holding out. Uh, what's going on over here? Oh, we have... Oh, you guys have arrived as well. Hey, Scotland's looking pretty good. But you know Canada, they're going to lose it. They probably will lose it eventually. Hey, I knew we'd get attacked, so just kind of hang out for now. Let you guys come on down. Flood the line. Let them stretch out their line so you can actually win. Hey, there you go. Nice. Very good, very good, very good. Actually, you guys are already there. Go ahead and move there. We have you moving up, so I'm not too worried about it. Hey, there you go. Good. Just don't lose. There you go. Now, they can still reinforce there, which isn't good. But that's okay. Nice. Austria has done a pretty good job. What are we still building? Roads. I like roads, but... Mm, I don't know, man. Oh, Scotland's looking really good. It might be time for us to join the war, but maybe, maybe not. We'll see what happens. Canada almost always ends up losing that, so it really sucks. And our guys, they just don't have the equipment levels yet for everything. How's our navy looking? I've not really touched navy at all this campaign. Or at least this episode. You guys have a carrier. You guys also have a carrier. So, how about you get another carrier? There you go. Nice. These guys are looking great. Move up. Go for that. Good. If you can, begin trying to move them, hurt them right there. That would be good, actually. Crush this part of Romania. That'd be awesome. Minus 5% stability. We could continue fighting the socialist terrorists. We do get more stability. I really want to make sure we get to here, though. Uh, that's our goal. That's our goal. We'll get rid of these terrorists eventually. We will. We will. Come on, help out, guys. Help out. Nice. They did. It's coming up there. I'm going to do Trial of Traders Companies next. Just don't want to finish that up, and maybe we'll end the episode there. Do we get anything from that? Cool. Only two weeks left, which is good. We've got to push across the river, which sucks. Sultan of Egypt. Cool. And boom, we won there. Hey, look at that. Beautiful. And we got to take that tower next. I'm totally not even paying attention to the German front. Good. Take this out. Bombings. Hate the bombings. Stop with the bombings. You lost the war. Get over it. Disperse. Cool. Anything here? Oh, we have plenty enough chromium now. Sorry, Russia. I'm glad I looked. We can get a thing of rubber then. Nice. Good stuff. Keep them there. Keep them there. That'd be... Oh, Afghanistan's... Oh, they were fighting... Oh, okay. I didn't realize that. Oh, uh, how about here? These guys probably can win here. Uh, we're fighting over a river, which sucks so much. We might still be able to win. There's only one division, so it's not too bad. They're still holding out. I might just join the war after the end of this episode, because they're doing pretty darn well. Uh, fighting Mexico would suck, but it wouldn't be the worst thing. Hey, we did it. We did it. We did it. War and peace studies. In the past, our diplomatic conduct has been at the whim of an ambassador, many of whom have bought their positions from the party. This, the world we live in is too dangerous to afford such flippant choices to be made by agents of America. It is Jonah MacArthur's opinion that a new approach to foreign policy is necessary, one that derives consensus from the group of trusted experts. This is what inspired the war and peace studies, a calling for the, only the brightest to represent America in this brave new world. This entity, the so-called Council on Foreign Relations, will advise MacArthur on how to suppress radical forces from any corner of the world, constrained by diplomats no more. That'd be good. Thank you. Please just give me one moment. Cool. Alright. 
Happy 1941, and we have another bombing. Oh, I'm tired of the bombings. And we have the trial of the treacherous company's fates of the unions. Ooh, that sounds pretty good. Air bases. Remove recovering from this. Oh. oh. Uh, that's not a terrible debuff. Empower the army. More stability. Control Congress. Uh, we could get more stability. Let's go. Let's do this one first. Fate of the unions. It is time for Congress to hear the testimony of rebellious unions. Some are calling for just their shared people to resign, while others insist on calling transcripts of union meetings, paving the way for prosecuting all active members. Ooh. Now that sounds like fun. Calling for the destruction of these unions. Sounds like a pretty good idea, but unfortunately, that seems like all the time for that we have today, my friends. We've done really well. Helping out the Moscow Accords for now, smashing the Reich's back, which will fall in the next episode. Let me know, should I join the the Entente immediately? You know, it looks like they're not doing well right there. Let me know in the comments below. Thank you very much for watching, and have a great rest of your day.